My name is Michael. I have a 16 2 draft called Duchess. I'm 12 years old and I live in Ireland. You're watching Day by Day Vlogs. Hope you enjoy the video. Bye! Good morning, day fam. Welcome to today's video. We are in for a crazy, crazy day. It is already 8 a.m. and I have Gabby up. Gabby, what are you doing up at 8 a.m.? I'm going to help with chores. You're going where? To the barn. Are you posting on Instagram? Yeah. This never happens, you guys. This is a miracle in the making. Can you see? She's actually posting on her Instagram account. It's happening. You did 29 posts? Wow. Well, like, since it started. All right, so listen, you might get a horse today. I know. Imagine all the pictures that you can post on Instagram once you get them. Yes. All right, get your coat on. Get your mitts on. Hurry up, it's cold out. Let's go. Chop, chop. Okay. Let's go. Wait. She has 29 posts. Seven of them are on Storm. That's a high percentage, and she doesn't even have them yet. Anyway, welcome to today. So many crazy things are happening today. Starting with Gabby getting up early, going to the barn. She's gonna work there with Fiona. Fiona's gonna bring her back, pick us up, and we're all gonna go to the vet check. It is happening super fast. Yeah, no, that is a way to make time fly by, huh? Did you get a drink? All right, get a drink. You can't run on no fuel. This girl can go the entire day and not eat a single solitary thing. And then or drink and then all of a sudden at four o'clock she's like a raging raging beast of hunger it's happening it's happening you guys crazy things are happening fiona just called me and said i'm four minutes away from your house the the guy is 30 minutes away from the barn and the barn is 30 minutes away from our house so uh, all this stuff and sophia <laughs> and she didn't brush her hair but we're ready to go wish us luck you guys it's craziness i'll be vlogging along the way though Whew. He just said hi, I heard him. Hi, this is a camera. It will be a part of your life forever. <laughs> so happy, you might as well get used to it. <laughs> oh, he's nice. Like a speech bubble. Yeah, it does look like a speech bubble. Like he's thinking. Yeah, plus he's smart. You get grouchy. You get grouchy. I just don't see you being a grouchy horse. Especially in the summer, he's gonna get even more riding. He really likes kids, I think it. Apparently all the kitties like this blanket. <laughs> probably, yeah, probably nice and warm. We're with Fiona and we're just getting gas. We're on our way home. But did you guys know that I have hardly driven in four years? I've hardly driven because when we moved into town, I sold my car because I didn't go anywhere. I was home with the girls all the time and everything is close to us. I could walk anywhere. I always had like a massive anxiety about driving because I didn't get my license to the for the very first time until I was 36 years old. I got my license, I did all the driving. I took the girls to daycare, I went to work and back, I did all the grocery shopping. I went everywhere all the time. I got really confident and really good at it. But since I have um, sold my car four years ago, I, uh, and maybe it's about three and a half years ago, I literally have anxiety when I drive now. It's been super scary for me. Right, Gabby? Yeah, so I have to sit in the front seat and help her. Yeah, so I put She's Gabby. Like, is that a green light or is it yellow? <laughs> no, That's a green light. no. We got a new car. 
All right, guys, my mom is driving and she's driving our new car. Yes, it's a van, it's a black van. It's a backup camera and I love it. <laughs> It'll make going to the barn a lot easier because when dad's not here, then we could just drive there because mom is driving low camera battery. Oh my gosh. But yes, guys, and I got a horse. <laughs> he passed the bed check on April 2nd. On April 2nd, but April 3rd, you'll be seeing this. I'll have him April 2nd. <laughs> So I can't wait for him. He has no limitations. Um, on the lameness, on the lameness check, he was a zero out of five, which is really good because like one, two, three, four, or five is like lame. Today we learned that he prefers to lope instead of trot. Yeah. It's either a jog or a lope. Doesn't want. Well, he, he's not a. He's not a trot boy. He's a canter boy. Yeah. And mom was like, yes! So, yeah. Yay. It's true, guys. We got a new car. And I'll tell you a bit about, a bit more about it when we got home. But it was quite the experience. We are finally home. We made it safe. I drove perfectly. I got gas for the very first time. It was so crazy. I went to get the car. And usually Sam does that kind of stuff. But he was at work. And Fiona was like, Let's just pick up the car on our way. And I was like, I don't want to do that. Like, I haven't driven for very long. And she's like, you'll be fine. So she kind of forced my hand. She's just good at that. We went in to pick up the car and he said, oh, you know, um, we always fill up the gas, the gas tank because they have like a jug of gas in the garage. And he said, I went to fill up your car and it was empty. So I'm just going to give you money and you're going to have to get gas. So he gave me $40 and said, here you go. And I said, Oh, I don't know how to get gas. I've never got gas before. I've never got gas before, you guys. And he's like, oh, and I said, I guess I'll figure it out. So I went outside and I said to Fiona, Fiona, he gave me money and I have to get gas. I don't know how to get gas. And she said, I'm going to walk you through it. So we, I followed her to the gas station and I got gas for the very first time. And it was kind of crazy and kind of scary, but I did it. And now I feel like I could probably do it again. <laughs> this is after all the times I told her, you want to learn to fill it up? And I yeah. said, I much prefer Sam doing it for me. Get Gabby to do it. I taught Gabby and Sophie no. how to fill up the tank. Yeah. yeah, but then I filled it up too much. And but you know what? That was the funniest thing. This is the funniest thing that ever happened in my life. We're Gabby and Fiona were at the barn doing chores and the vet said, hey, I'm only 30 minutes away. So she's like, oh no. And they jumped in the car and they raced to get us. And they're like, come on, we have to go really fast. So we start driving and a car pulls in um, in front of Fiona. Oh. And Fiona's in the car going, clicking at the car and I'm like looking at her thinking like are you for real or are you just pretending because my kids click at everything and I said are you doing that on purpose she goes I can't help it I click at everything I click at cars and I click at people <laughs> she literally sits in her car and clicks at people at cars when she wants well, them to get out of her not, way at least she's not kissing at everybody <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. that's so funny <laughs> one more thing about the van so uh, we got a van that's what we were keeping from you i got a car because it's gonna change our life again you guys now that i have some place to go i'm actually gonna be able to go there so when it's warm and in the summer when sam is at work and we want to go to the barn and hang out and ride our horses and do whatever we want there we can go we can go wherever we want now it's going to change our videos because we won't be at home during the week all the time it's just going to make a huge difference to our videos and to our horses who we'll get to see more often and some of you guys guessed right okay so gabby get over here the thing you've all been waiting for did storm pass the vet check yes i'm going to make a separate video of the vet check right now hopefully it'll be up soon after this video um so you guys can see it and okay. see what happened and see what happens in a vet check. And, okay, so, so did he pass the vet check? Yes. He uh, passed it with flying colors, you guys. Yeah. The vet said in in um, <coughs> the hard pot part, was trotting him like 18 times. Yeah, Gabby had to do all the running. The owner and our instructor was like, thank goodness Gabby came because she had to do all the running with him. Um, anyway, he passed everything. There was not, the vet had this many concerns about her horse. Zero, zero concerns. He uh, 
tested everything perfectly. The only thing that he has a problem with is he's a little bit lazy, right? He's a little bit lazy. Yeah. That's fine, because mo like blue, he's way less lazier than blue. Blue is Yeah, he's really responsive. So he's responsive, yes. he's just doesn't he's just lazy. So he's um, just lazy. But also, we learned today that he prefers to jog a western trot or canter. Yeah, his favorite mode of travel is canter, which Gabby's like, yay, because that's her favorite mode of canter too. She canters yes, everywhere. For that's her favorite mode of tra transportation. Yeah, so hopefully his slides don't give out like hers. But anyway, um, another positive thing was that he loves the kids so much. Yay. When we went there today, she said he had been really grouchy with her. And as soon as he saw them, he was so responsive and was like, oh my, like he's, he loves kids. And he's like Ruby. Yeah, he, he's like the Ruby of the dogs. And she said that um, it's been really hard on her knowing that he's leaving because, and she doesn't have a new horse yet. And she said that um, the thing that's really keeping her going through the whole thing is that he's going to kids and his reaction to kids is so strong that she's yeah. really excited. So I was like telling her stuff about our barn and what it's like and how many kids are there and she's really happy. She works him four times a week. I asked about his training program and she works him hard four times a week. So we've got our work cut out for us. We asked about, he looks tiny bit, or he looks stiff to us because we don't know what we're, what we're looking for. He looks stiff in the back and he said it's just the way that he's walking and she, he said he doesn't see it. He says if he looks really, really, really close for like a split second, he'll see it, but then it's gone and he can't even tell if he even ever saw it. So he thinks it's just a him thing, it's just how he, it's because he's lazy and how he walks. So yeah, it went really well and we are getting a horse, you guys. We bought a horse, like, I can't wait. We have so many fun things to share with you. So many things we've bought, so many things that we have for him. It's just gonna be an amazing time. Okay, comment of the day, you guys. We only do comment of the day when we can. If our video is like so super packed with stuff, then usually on weekends, then we don't. But um, yeah, so we try and do them during the week, so. Uh, Maria Diana asks, are you getting a car, Laura? Animal Lifestyle says, awesome video. Sophie, you were amazing in your lesson. You're getting so much better. Sorry to hear about Jasmine. She has had many joyful moments with you, and I'm sure Fiona will have her going to a very good home. She actually has already a home. She was a lease horse, so <coughs> she has a horse, or she has a... She has a home? She has a home. She's just going back there. Um, so, Bella Bennett, this is a good one. Bella Bennett says Lola is a bay. Buckskins have black legs, a black mane and tail, and a creamy body. Duns are similar, except their fur can be darker. And I asked today, and Lola is a, a buckskin. buckskin. She's a sooty buckskin. Um, yeah. She said. I think it's a sooty. Sooty. Sooty buckskin. Sooty, because like soot. Yeah. Soot. She's a sooty buckskin. And I asked about it today and she said that she's harder to, she's easier to see her color in the summertime. That she does kind of look bay. But then 3Q1 Nox, 3Q1 Nox, 3Q1 Nox <laughs> said uh, um, she could be a sooty buckskin. They can get that dark. And you're right, she is a sooty buckskin. Anyway, um, what color is our horse? Because we found out today, we there were some questions. Just he, wait, just wait, just wait. Um, there's some question, a bunch of people were saying, he's not a bay horse, he's a chocolate horse, or for all these different variations. But we found it today, she looked at his records, and what color is our horse? Bay. He's actually a bay. He's a bay yeah. horse. She's exactly at Gabby's dream, right? Like a blackish bay. Gabby will be making a video all about her horse, and we'll have so much information I about him. I think it's already up. No, she's gonna be making a video all about her horse, like oh, all the information, his so name, send me questions his like, registered name. Send me questions on Twitter, on, on Instagram. On no, because I won't see it. On Instagram? No, because I'm never on Instagram <laughs> except for posting videos. Okay, in the comments below. On my channel, comment on uh, one of my videos, like on my newest video. Comment more. Um, Gabby has a video out, <laughs> right? Yes. Went out last night. So she's saying, could you comment on that video and send her questions for questions about her horse because yeah, she's going like to be able to. Yeah, like a Q&A for my horse. Yeah, that's what she wants to do. Well, not, yeah, kind I'll of. I'll shoot it, shoot it when I have him. Yeah. Uh, so that's probably. another question. When are you getting your horse, Gabby? A day after Easter. <laughs> yeah, so it's a long weekend, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. It's a long Easter weekend here. 
Um, so we will oh, get him. getting him Monday to yeah. give my lesson. Yeah. I'm writing screen though. I know Monday. That. Monday or Tuesday? I don't know. Monday is a holiday. Easter is, a holiday. is on. Easter's on. Yeah. Anyway, I think we're getting him on Monday. So uh, that is it for today, you guys. Hope you like this video. Uh, if you're interested in uh, seeing the vet check, go ahead and it, um, there should be a video up really soon on this channel of the whole entire vet check. See you guys later. Bye. 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 to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.